sleep apnea, in my opinion, is mother of all sleep disorders. It is, its effect is underestimated and is underdiagnosed. When we go through a sleep and the oxygen drops because of the apnea, the brain tries to adapt and adjust to these major changes because of the drop in the oxygen. These adjustments could be increasing our heart rate, increasing our blood pressure, and effect on the blood flow, to the, especially to our heart and our brain. The result of this could be heart attack in the middle of the night, strokes, and other effects. There is a major changes in the hormonal system in our body occurs because of the apnea and change in the oxygen. These hormonal changes affect our behavior. We are tired and we are short-tempered in the morning. It affects other parts of our hormonal systems. It can affect our immune system. It can affect our sex hormones. It can cause or contribute to impotence. In children, sleep apnea has opposite effect. It makes children to become hyperactive. It can affect the growth of the kids because of the growth hormone is affected uh, as a result of lack of oxygen and the apnea. A lot of patients with sleep apnea, they wake up with headaches or the headaches wakes them up at the middle of the night. So this is a serious problem that causes headaches in the patients. The end result of the sleep apnea is very simple. It affects our physical well-being as well as our mental well-being. And we, if we don't sleep well at night because of the apnea, we are tired physically the next day and we are mentally not 100%. This is a serious health issue. Patients need to see a sleep specialist in order to get a proper treatment for this condition.